25 schools across the country are piloting NCEA Level 1 English, Science, Religious Studies and Visual Arts this school year. Three of these schools shared with us their experience thus far. The Mini Pilot is a test run of the process for piloting standards and supporting resources ahead of a Mini Pilot of all NCEA Level 1 subjects in 2022. Garen College is part of the Mini Pilot for Religious Studies. The new standards definitely allow scope for creativity and doing things a little bit differently. Fortunately there's enough of the standards that have familiar content not to throw teachers too far off their mark. Here at Fiktani High School we've been piloting the Level 1 English standards to the whole school. One of the things that we've found as teachers is it's been a huge disruptor to our everyday teaching practice. It's really forced us out of our comfort zone. It has been a challenge, but it's been a really valuable challenge, and I think it's going to be one that is really beneficial to our students. So we've been part of the mini pilot project with visual arts. Content hasn't really changed significantly from what we used to do. We were developing a new program anyway, and on the whole, I think most people will be able to actually see how their programs can adapt across to it. The biggest change is that there's a lot more student-led learning. So students have a lot more responsibility for their own learning and the choices in terms of the text that they select. This has meant that we've had better engagement from our students because they're actually selecting and studying texts that they actually enjoy and that are relevant to them. Most of the standards are significantly lower word limits. The students are taking a while to get this because they are used to thinking that excellence means lots more words. But of course that's not the case. We're looking for quality, not quantity. They're definitely getting that and they're learning to consolidate their ideas much better. With the pilot, the timings are a little bit different and certainly stacked towards the end of the year for a lot of the assessments. They're not getting as much feedback at the moment as far as grades are concerned. So we need to communicate with them really clearly as to where they're at and how they're progressing and that's been really important. If you're doing the pilots next year, my advice would be to get on board in terms of professional development by the end of this year. We all know how busy the school calendar year is, so you need to plan very specifically for your own school's needs. I would really encourage people to look at the assessment activities and get a clear idea of exactly what you're going to be teaching and what's going to be working best for the students in front of you. So we'll continue with the Mini Pilot next year. We've already jumped in boots and all and it'll be pretty crazy to go backwards now. The new standards are coming up anyway, so why not keep going? It's been a huge challenge, but I think it's been a really important challenge. We needed that disruption because NCA isn't working for some of our students. So we need to make changes to make it more equitable. Thank you.